Padawan. I'm Satil Shan, leader of the Jedi Council. I'd like to speak privately with you before we meet with the others. You have my full attention, Master. What do you need? This isn't a discussion for a comm channel. Come to my meditation room in the temple. We'll talk there. Welcome, Padawan. The temple is already buzzing with accounts of your heroism in the training grounds. Master Orgus told me you battled Flesh Raiders, and a Force user armed with a lightsaber. That must have been a disturbing confrontation. Are you alright? I'm sorry things ended in violence, but I'm glad to be alive. Taking a life affects the Living Force, and the one who does the killing. This is why Jedi enter battles calmly with reason. Emotions like fear and anger lead to the dark side. I can control my feelings, no matter what I'm facing. As the Jedi Code teaches us, there is no emotion, there is peace. Remember those words when times are darkest. And take this. The Code is a source of strength, but some backup never hurts. I'll see you soon in the Council Chambers. I searched the Temple Archives. This Force user leading the Flesh Raiders never received Jedi training. Then the Sith have found us. Shouldn't we get ready for them? Calm yourself, Padawan. We can't be certain of anything yet. But we've all sensed a growing darkness. Perhaps it's finally revealed itself. The enemy I faced wanted to destroy the Jedi Order. Can't get much darker than that. Well, that brightened up the room. Everyone, this is the Padawan who saved our people in the training grounds. This is Master Kiwix and her extremely vocal Padawan, Kira. The other Masters are transmitting from distant worlds. It's unfortunate our numbers are scattered. Indeed. The Temple's safety is unexpectedly threatened. The Flesh Raiders were disorganized primitives before today. They carry blasters and work like an army. We need to find out why. The man leading the Flesh Raiders probably wasn't acting alone. Much of Tython remains unexplored, and we have few resources to spare. I'll handle it, with the help of my new Padawan. Orgus, you haven't taken a Padawan since Coruscant. The Force is strong in him, stronger than I've seen in decades. I can think of no finer master to complete this Padawan's training. I'll complete my final trials once we've dealt with the Flesh Raiders. That is what you should aspire to, Kira. You'll find supplies in my chambers downstairs. Go equip yourself. I'll meet you there. those council meetings. I'd die of old age before my colleagues ran out of things to say. I'd rather do something about problems than discuss them. Still, there are times when talking is exactly what's needed. This situation has come to you fast. You're braving dangers many Jedi never face. I wouldn't blame you for having questions. This may be the only time to ask them. I'll make sense of things later. Let's find our enemy. I know people who can help. There's a group of Twi'lek pilgrims on Tython. They've been fighting the Flesh Raiders for months. The Republic asked us to deny those Twi'leks aid. They settled here illegally. But frankly, we need them. How are they violating the law? When Tython was first rediscovered, the Twi'leks petitioned the Senate to settle here. Their claim was denied, too dangerous, but they came anyway. The Twi'leks have a settlement in the mountains. That's your next stop. 
Establish a base camp and speak to the Matriarch. Find out everything the Twi'leks know about Flesh Raiders. I'm ready to get back out there. Do some good. I'll join you soon. May the Force be with you.